Hey you guys, Dangerous Thing here. Welcome back to another episode of Boom Beach and thanks again for stopping by and checking in with me. So today, as you can see, obviously we're playing Boom Beach and a lot is going on on our base. So many things can be upgraded right now, but really I am saving up the loot for another landing craft upgrade. You know I've been concentrating on upgrading all of my landing crafts so I can be the most offensive I could ever be uh, at my level. So I am currently retraining a few of my Zookas because I just finished an attack and uh, basically last I checked I was about to well let's go ahead and insta train this so I can actually be certain I am about 103 diamonds short uh, on the upgrade which means that we are going to jump in and do some jolly raiding so let's check in which villages we've lost in the last day or so um, and look at this you guys Thrifty Cent, which is funny because it reminds me of 50 Cent. Okay, so Thrifty Cent here has got his base all decked out with a, um, I don't know, with a cool little shield generator all the way in the back. But I think we can take this, I think we can take this base down. So let's take a quick peek at the stats of his rocket launchers. And then let's open it up with an awesome, awesome attack. And look at that, you guys. He's got shock mines. Okay, so if he's got shock mine, he's level 21. Gosh darn it. I am extremely jealous right now. I am completely jelly beans. He's got all his shock mines. And meantime, I'm not even level 21 yet. Okay, but enough crying. I cannot be a crybaby. I gotta jump in and I gotta attack. Um, I think I may go home and boost one of my statues uh, because he's got shock launchers through the roof. Okay, um, yeah, I'll boost the statue. How many power powders do I have? Let's check it out. 26. Mm, no, 26. I'm not gonna boost. I had like 50 before uh, the crab appeared again on the map and now I'm down to 26. So I'm I'm gonna save them up and try and get through this without spending um, an additional power powder. Okay, let's go ahead and start with the shock launcher and rocket launcher. Ooh, look at that, that was actually really nice. All right, let's concentrate on this guy right now over here. And then I think I can take out the uh, this guy over here with, um, with the Yes, okay, lovely. I took it out with the quarry and now we're going to take care of uh, this guy. Let's see if two barrages were enough, two artillery shots were enough actually. Let's go ahead and barrage this shock launcher over here and then we will deploy my ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so um, now that we have all the rocket launchers and shock launchers down, I will go ahead and start from the left hand side and the logic here is that because it is least, I don't know, least dangerous looking to me, <laughs> I should have actually flared at the, uh, uh, at the defense buildings instead of taking out the gold storage, but that's okay. I feel like we can be, uh, we can still uh, do quite well over here. Okay, so I need to patch up my Zooks right away. They are all, all, all um, not looking good there. They were not looking good there for a second. And let's go ahead and continue on and move closer and closer to the base, you guys, and to the uh, HQ of the base. I cannot speak sometimes when I get too excited or too nervous and I don't really know which one I am right now. Am I excited? Am I nervous? I'm not nervous. I mean, I'm winning this, you guys. Look at this. I am absolutely positively winning this. There is no question in my mind. The shield generator was not at all an issue and definitely lost a few troops there. I think I've lost about five heavies, four heavies and uh, like two Zookas, but not so bad overall. Um, Let's see what our losses were. We got two medals and lost ooh, seven heavies and one Zooka. Darn. I also wish that my supply chest was up for the renewal because I just got two medals, you guys, two victory points, but it's okay. All right, let's go back home now and see. Ooh, we are ready for an upgrade, uh, but I think I will wait a second. Or maybe actually I'll start the upgrade and then we'll go and do a couple more raids. Uh, until we run out of the troops and uh, obviously I can't retrain the troops. I can't retrain the troops until the upgrade is completed, which will be 
17 hours and 59 minutes from now. So let's go ahead and rate a few bases, shall we? Uh, I can possibly push for Dr. T uh, in this video, you guys. Which, by the way, I know I've mentioned that I really wanted to push myself a bit harder and uh, try and complete Dr. T because I just recently, for the first time in my Boom Beach Live, was able to finish the uh, Gear Heart event. And that was absolutely thrilling, you guys. I am telling you, I was jumping up and down as I was sitting down for dinner with my friends, and they probably thought that. I don't know I had like a an epileptic attack or something because I was literally shaking but it was such an exhilarating feeling and I love love loved it so I really want to uh, you know push for Dr. T because that would be amazing the furthest I've gone so far with Dr. T was level 6 which is not great because it's only one step away from the victory but it's one step too far and I can never ever complete it you guys and it's so heartbreaking my little heart breaks every single time so what I'm gonna try to do in next couple of days is to push for a Dr. T victory so let's uh, actually cover up my ladies and gentlemen here patch them up and heal them up uh, critters go and here we are you guys we will be ready to take down Dr. T stage 5 in just a second boom come on Zuka's boom one more boom and one last boom and down it goes so as i was saying you guys i really want to get through all of the dr t levels and uh yeah this will be basically on the agenda and will be my prime directive which recently i've been quoting a ton of mr spock in my videos and maybe it's because i have been watching all of the original series of star trek and feel like a complete nerd um but yeah i really want to get through dr t and uh uh, you probably are gonna hear a lot more about it because I am pretty obsessed with the idea of completing it. So look at this level six, you guys. Uh, because one of my landing crafts is upgrading and I can't be retraining the troops on that landing craft and I've actually lost two Zookas there. Uh, I can attempt it, but I only have so few heavies. So maybe I will actually just leave this out right here, a super short Boom Beach video, just telling you that, um, you know, I want to get through Dr. T and that I'm upgrading all of my uh, landing crafts. And um, oh yeah, actually in one of the videos, you guys, one of you asked me if I'm gonna upgrade my sculptor to level six. And uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but it's actually level seven right now. And right now we are crafting a masterpiece, an ice masterpiece, which I'm probably going to crush and get my seven power powders out of it right away. Um, but okay, you guys, super short video and super random. No exact objective other than upgrading my landing craft and uh, basically just saying hello. I will see you in the next episode during which hopefully I will be able to take out Dr. T and complete all seven levels. Until then, you guys, GT is out. Mm -hmm.